Many people wonder what's normal when it comes to period flow. The medical term for heavy periods is menorrhagia. A normal amount of blood loss is between 6 and 8 teaspoonfuls per period and bleeding can last up to 8 days but typically on average it lasts for 5. Double this amount of blood loss is considered heavy but it's impossible for people to measure so it's actually much more important to go off the symptoms that somebody's having. If this is of interest, you think it affects you, then hit pause now and look at this long list. If you answer yes to two or more, or if heavy bleeding is stopping you from doing the things that you want to do, then it's worth discussing with your GP. In about 50% of cases of heavy periods, the cause is unknown, and this is called dysfunctional uterine bleeding. This is when the womb and ovaries are normal, there's no hormonal problem, and periods are usually regular. The other half of cases are mostly caused by conditions affecting the womb, ovaries, or hormones, such as polycystic ovary syndrome, fibroids, endometriosis, adenomyosis, and pelvic inflammatory disease. Some medicines and treatments can also cause it, especially anticoagulant drugs and some chemotherapy medicines. And what about clots? Well, menstrual clots are a mixture of blood cells, tissue from the lining of the uterus, and proteins in the blood that help regulate the flow, and they are normal. However, passing large clots, say larger than a 10 pence piece, along with other symptoms of menorrhagia may not be normal. Speak to your GP if you've noticed an unusual change, if you're worried, or if you have symptoms that are impacting your quality of life.